Hi, good morning. I am Abdul, your pharmacist. How can I help you? Good morning. I have a problem with paracosme in my legs. I was diagnosed by my GP and I wasn't given any medication about it because my GP says it's a minor condition. Mm -hmm. But I would like to do something about it. Uh -huh. I heard that butcher's broom or horse chestnut might be fit for me. I see. Well, did you, do you mind if I ask you any, any questions if these products are suitable for you or not? Sure. Okay. So, do you have any medical conditions or do you take any other medications? I saw my GP for my hemorrhoid. Mm -hmm. I'm not taking any medication for it either. Alright. May I know if you have any allergies? No, not, not that I'm aware of. Okay, that's great. May I know if... Um, where did you came... Uh, this, uh, where did you came by this information from? I was told about post chestnut and which is boomed by a colleague. I'm interested to know more about them. What do you think of these products? Do they work? Well, uh, actually, uh, the both pro both products are traditional herbal medicinal products, so which means they are prescribed on traditional uh, uses uh, basis. And the for the horse chestnut, uh, it has been traditionally used to relieve. Uh, symptoms associated with varicose veins such as tired heavy legs pains and swelling okay. and uh, butcher's broom has been used traditionally to relieve the symptoms of uh, discomfort and heaviness of legs associated with um, minor circulation problems and to relieve symptoms of itching burning associated with hemorrhoids so would you like to have a look on those products oh, yes please Okay, this is the uh, Venoforce, and which comes in capsules containing the horse chestnut seeds. Okay. And the other product is uh, Vitovin, which contains uh, butcher's brome rhizome. Mm -hmm. okay. um, how do they work? Well, um, the active, uh, there are an active chemical constituents that uh, targets the venous circulation which pumps the blood from your veins back to your heart okay so uh, by helping this venous circulation become more efficient these products are thought to relieve the symptoms of varicose vein and hemorrhoids in mild cases such as yours so and the main active ingredient in the horse chestnut actually is something called acin. Okay. Um, this will act on your blood capillary membranes uh, by preventing the fluid from leaking out from from these veins, and thereby uh, so that as a result, this will reduce your um, swelling and improve the circulation. While in butcher's broom. They have uh, the active constituents uh, called uh, glycosides, and it includes uh, riscogenin and neuroriscogenin. Okay. Don't be worried about this <laughs> difficult <laughs> terms. Yeah, no, I just want to mention you that. It's, uh, um, it's very complicated. Yeah. yeah. This um, this might cause also the blood vessel to be constricted and uh, be more narrow. Okay. So as a result, this will improve the uh, circulation and preventing the blood from pooling from the, the veins. Okay, yeah, I just have one question. Are there any side effects? Well, uh, venovors uh, can sometimes uh, cause uh, some dizziness or headache, uh, stomach absent and itching. While vitovin can cause sometimes some nausea and stomach problems, diarrhea. But uh, since they are both acting on circulation, also it might co it might cause some uh, changes in blood pressure. And as you don't have any allergies or kidney, liver, di diabetes, and any oh, other I'll problems, yeah, yeah that will be fine, I think. Yeah. Okay. So, which product would you recommend for me? Well, I would suggest that you take both products. Um, the Vitovin is good for your hemorrhoids, and the other one, the Venoforce, is good for your varicose veins. And these products are both are taken orally. Okay. Yeah. So, okay. How often should I take them? Well, when Vitovin, one Vitovin capsule should be taken three times daily with meal, and the Venoforce should. Be taken twice daily after food. So I can take both of them after food. Yeah.
Okay. No, the phytofin is taken with meal. With meal. Yeah, and the other one, vit uh, venophil, is taken after, okay. after meals. I see. So, and if you didn't uh, notice any improvement in your condition, you could uh, consult uh, your GP again. Oh, okay. So I think I'll take both of them. So thank you very okay. much for your time. You are welcome, and let me know if you need any further help. Thanks. Thank you. Bye.